All right, great people. All right, my people. I would like to say good morning, good afternoon, good evening, according to your time zone. I am back again today with reality. Everything that I'm going to say here is authentic information, fact and figure. And that's not how anyone can dispute it. You see, I told my people everything that I'm saying is a gospel. I want you people to understand this. And I want you all to pay attention to this photo that I have next to my video right now. Of course, a lot of you know about this picture and know the guy in particular. But there is something that I want to tell our people that some of you don't even understand what is going on or what is playing out there. That is why I'm here. Authentic information authentic intel there is no two ways about it but my problem is i don't know why those people that supposed to be talking about all these things are today mute they are all mute and i have waited long time for them to speak out but i'm not hearing any of them let me give you a little bit story about this picture of this guy that I have here because some of you people did not see, I mean, did not saw that video when I dropped it. Uh, the name of this guy is Ntiwa. I did a video last month. I am also standing to be corrected. I don't, I cannot be able to tell you the date that I did that video. When one guy caught some, some people in a market square collecting money from old women, they turned themselves as a tax collector. They have already placed themselves on a salary. So there's a guy that saw them. I mean, the atrocity they are committing against our people by collecting money from the market people those that are selling cola nuts, those that are selling gary and bitter cola and there's a guy they call engineer that caught them on that act of crime in a market square and the guy was vidoring them unfortunately the guy asked them who send you people on this mission of collecting money from our market people which is the market women's, the old women's. And when you see those people that are collecting those money, they are young like me. Even though some are more, you know, their age are more younger than me. You understand what I'm saying? So when they ask them who sent them, he said that this is the guy that I'm showing you people the picture now is the one that sent them on that mission of collecting money from the market women. When the guy came there, you know, he was turning everything upside down. After the video ended, within some days, some weeks, this guy called Ntiwa by the command of the one called General Butuzo. They went an operation, about seven of them. They went and killed that guy that was interrogating them. And his name is what? Engineer. They killed Engineer. They killed engineer because, uh, they, of course, they are the same people. But engineer begin to understand that these people are going, I mean, more deeper. They, this thing, they're not supposed to be doing it. And the engineer went further and created his own group. And they come for him and they killed him. Today, engineer is no more. Today, engineer left a wife and kid there. I don't know who he won them to take care of the family but when they were involving in criminality they don't even reason who sent them i don't know who sent them now the question that i'm asking now or some of you are waiting to hear from me is what i'm about to tell you people and i will shock every one of you let me introduce myself before i will go in detail all right great people all right freedom fighters Lovers of freedom, great people all over the world. You are welcome once again on IBOB Rapture Media under the leadership of Mazin Nandio Kukano. 
where we always set the record straight. My name's all Mazo Kenina Okechuku, known as the Piafran Child Wachineke, the general. Now listen very, very big attentively, because everything that is coming out from my mouth is authentic fact and figure. Like I said, I have been waiting for over three days to hear from those that infiltrated those our men, lying to them, get them confused about Biafran Restoration Project, put them into criminality. I have been waiting for them for three days now to speak. All of them are mute. All of them are mute. I am not seeing them. I want to ask this guy called himself the dragon. He also called himself ESN Unjoko. He also called himself autopilot Biafran spokesman. He also called himself government in exile. I want to ask Simon Eber in Finland, the guys that you people have infiltrated, they are taking them one after the other. Why are you people mute? I want you people to understand that this guy you are seeing this picture now, called Ntiwa, is gone. This guy you are seeing this picture is gone. And none of them are talking about him. None of them are speaking about him. I want to ask Bridget Okafo. I want to ask Nelly Ofebu. I want to ask Rabbit Charles. I want to ask Madan Oyibo. Those people, you people infiltrated, why are you not talking about them? They are killing them one after the other. They are naming them one after the other. Baby have gone. Uh, Double Lion have gone. Uh, what is his name? Uh, Bugari have gone. This one you are seeing his picture now, Ntiwa, is gone. The one they are calling, uh, what is his name? Um, um, Agu Biafra. That one is gone. Three days ago, the Nigerian military, Boko Haram terrorists in Nigerian uniform went to their camp and they maimed all of them. They maimed all of them. All of them is gone today. But my problem is why all these people that I mentioned, their name are mute. Why are they mute? Why are they not talking about those people that they have already infiltrated? Those people that they have went down and get confused that they are not, you know, by using the money we have in whom will account. Like I am speaking to you people today, in whom will your account, the account is zero because they have already squandered the money by infiltrating our people on the ground by lying to them when the money is gone money is not coming again they are now tell them to go into criminality now they went into criminality to the extent that these people are now settling land for people settling case for people smashing cars smashing motorbikes using their house as a cell and prison when they kidnap person the person must pay ransom before they release them today what i'm bringing to you is authentic news go and ask simon Ibirima. go and ask nelly ufebu ask bridget okafo ask rabbit shas ask madan Oibo. those men that they are they infiltrated by our money in umeri account where are they today where are they today even though the one of their commander which is in Tijuana, that is down now they don't want to talk about him all of them they are mute all of them from beginning to the end they are mute that is my question to them you know they are doing all this says when they went down our leader have told us down with that number don't double into our men's on the ground don't call our men on the ground but because of the idiocy because of the you know the agenda in these people because they want to destroy what mazin namdekano have built for years that is why they double into our men on the ground and because of poverty and hunger our people accepted this you know the, the i mean they accepted this i don't know what they really tell them or told them i don't really know what they told them 
before they believe all these things. Today, they are taking them, Nigerian government are taking them one after the other. Because now they are now beginning to believe that all these people are Mazen Namdekan backbone. That is why they went to underground. That is why you see a Birima in Finland call himself Njoko can went on on a meeting with somebody that Mazen Namdekan himself expelled. He was in the same meeting, they set up government in exile. Now, Abba Pugia, and now he's crying. Abba Pugia, that is not the reason why I'm here. The reason why I'm here is to tell you people that this guy they call him Tiwa is gone. Three days ago, I keep on waiting since three days ago for me to hear from a Birima, which is their spokesperson to come and announce it that their men are falling but nobody said anything nobody is saying anything a very man in finland called simon ever is not saying anything bridget to car for that second camp here and there is not saying anything rabbit shots that want to stole radio biafra from us is not saying anything oh madam oh you go that uh, water her ground with hundred audio money hundred thousand dollars audio money fake money they are not talking they are not saying anything. There are men that have infiltrated. They are going down one after the other. They are not saying anything. But you know the reason why I'm saying this? These people are not our men anymore. Because I keep on telling our people this. If you are IPOP yesterday and they infiltrated you today, and tomorrow you are involved into criminality. You are not part of us. You can never be part of us. This is what I'm bringing to you all today. I want you people to go out there and begin to ask Simon Eber in Finland. Ask Bridget Okafo. Ask Madano Yibo. Ask Rabbit Charles. Why are they mute? And the people that infiltrated, they have finished all of them. Do you know what Marami wrote? Marami wrote the reason why they will not release Mars and Namdekano. That the insecurity in Biafra land is caused by Mars and Namdekano. But this was the cause by the infiltrators. These people that I mentioned their name begin to ask them a question. Go and ask the spokesman why are they not talking about the men that are falling? They, even though on that day, on that particular day, which is three days ago, this man that I'm showing you a picture is gone. The one they called Abu Biafra is gone. The same day they killed more than 12 people are the same particular because they went to their camp. And I don't know the reason why these people are not talking. That is what I bring to you all. Begin to ask questions. This I said now is fact and figure. Ask them, they will tell you. Nobody will say it apart from me. On this Biafran restoration project, we have come to stay. Good day and welcome.